I'm Jerry Reynolds, the Car Pro, and welcome to another edition of the Automotive News in Two Minutes. Believe it or not, completely driverless cars may be right around the corner. Toyota and Ford already have cars that'll parallel park for you. General Motors thinks it will road test a completely automated vehicle by just 2015. But if you haven't seen it yet, Google's already logged more than 140,000 miles in a driverless Prius that uses cameras, lasers, and GPS maps to navigate. In fact, it's a real world version of Kit from Knight Rider, and it's working so well, the company is currently lobbying for new laws that would allow driverless cars to operate legally. Right now, that's going on in the state of Nevada. The goal is to eliminate all human error and prevent car accidents and traffic jams. Google says its cars will still have the option of letting you drive, going from automated to manual, much like your cruise control does now. Now from a driverless car to one that'll do just about everything else for you. This is the 2011 Mercedes-Benz CL63 AMG. Not often do automotive journalists like me get to drive a $166,000 car like this one, and it'll do just about anything you need it to. In fact, the seats will even give you a massage while you drive. This is a whole new CL class for Mercedes. It's got an updated look on the outside from the single chrome bar across the grille to quad tailpipes in the back. Now once you get inside, this car may be more comfortable than your living room. The seat adjusts 14 different ways and yes, the seats will give you a massage. The whole entertainment and information system is controlled by a single joystick on the console, but the big story's under the hood. New technology has made this car's V8 much more powerful and yet much more fuel efficient at the same time. It's got everything to do with dual fuel pumps and an upgraded ignition system, but the bottom line is this AMG Performance Package engine is rated at 563 horsepower. This big car goes from zero to 60 in about 4.3 seconds, but you'll still get 15 miles to the gallon in the city and 21 on the highway. Now finally, what about getting your car back after 36 years from it being stolen? This guy named Keith Williams in California bought a 69 Camaro SS off eBay, but he quickly became suspicious of it, so he went to the police and asked them to investigate. They went out and found the original owner in New Jersey and returned the car. Williams had bought buyer's insurance, so he wasn't out any money either. What a happy story. I'm Jerry Reynolds, the Car Pro. Catch me on the radio Saturdays in Houston, San Antonio, Austin, Los Angeles, Sacramento, Lubbock, Texas, and Dallas, Fort Worth. Check the website carproshow.com for showtimes and details. I'm Jerry, the Car Pro. Have a great week.